Did you know that one in six children in this country struggles with hunger, including one in five kids in Georgia? Well, No Kid Hungry is doing its part to end childhood hunger by providing much needed meals and education. Somalia Chair Gil Coolers from Piedmont Driving Club is here to talk about their upcoming fundraiser that's this Sunday. That's correct. Very exciting. Yes, the 12th year. That's right. Forgive me five. Yes, indeed. All We're right. All, all very excited here. We have some of the some of the best chefs uh, uh, in town. Uh, Matt Marcus from the uh, watershed, and uh, I've I've put together some of the. Uh, I've been able to call on some of the best sommeliers in, in town who've uh, made excellent pairings. Also, we'll, we'll have some very good service at uh, uh, this Sunday's dinner. So Fantastic. And this is the 12th year, Forgive Me Five, that benefits No Kid Hungry. Why do you think the event has been so successful for 12 years now? Well, I think uh, part of the reason is, one, we bring in some of the, like I just said, we bring mm -hmm. in some of the best chefs in town. Uh, we pair them with the, uh, the, the, the wine experts in Atlanta. Uh, and it's just the, it, it is really a, a one of the funnest events. And if, if you're into food or wine at, at any level, okay. you'll want to come to this. So there's an attraction, uh, but also, you know, all the money we raise, 100% of the, uh, the, f um, the proceeds actually go to the charities, which, which feed a lot of hungry right. kids Right, I was day. so impressed with that. And we talked about this a little bit. Mm -hmm. 100% uh, of the proceeds. That doesn't just mean the ticket sales. Ta uh, describe what you were talking about. No, I mean about a lot. I mean around. a lot of charities. I mean they, their hearts are absolutely in the right places, but it costs a lot of money. You need a, you have venue costs. You have costs for the for the glassware and the, oh, of course all the wine and you know the veal mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, all the other uh, food products. There's a cost to that, and a lot of times your ticket your ticket price goes to pay some of those costs. Well, uh, with the Give Me Five dinner. We all contribute not only our time, but quite a bit of money. The uh, food purveyors are very, very generous. The wine and liquor uh, distributors here in town, uh, we could not do what we do without them. And it's really part of our success because um, you know, we really are able to fund a lot of programs right. here in, in Georgia. Truly 100% with basically no overhead. That is fantastic. Now let's really hone in on No Kid Hungry. Mm -hmm. What exactly does No Kid Hungry do for the community? Well, the problem in the United States, and certainly here in Georgia, as you said earlier, one in five kids in Georgia, that's a lot of mm -hmm. kids. Yeah. Um, they either are plain old hungry, or they really don't know where their next meal is coming from. A lot of kids who are in these situations, they do get uh, a free or reduced uh, um, uh, uh, school lunch, school yeah. lunches, and breakfast, and, and that's great during the week. And and that really does; those are great programs, and they do help uh, uh, kids uh, get by. But you know what happens on the weekend? What happens on spring break? Right. Geez, what happens during the summer? Right. And they really don't know. Either they are indeed going hungry, um, or they really are just. Uh, they just don't know where their next meal is coming from. And when you're hungry, um, you're not studying as well as you could. Oh, there's, there, there's a lot of uh, downside uh, to, to this that it's just you know, hard for a lot of people to really get their mind around. Exactly. And we talked a little bit about how exactly No Kid Hungry goes about doing their work. And you described it as No Kid Hungry is sort of the bank that then distributes to their local partners who mm -hmm. actually get the food to the kids. Right? I mean, I think a lot of the viewers remember we uh, we also do Taste of the Nation. Uh, that's more Fantastic that, event. That, that, yeah, wasn't it? <laughs> um, another fun event, but that's more of a, a big uh, sort of a walk around thing. This is actually a sit down five, five course, course dinner. Yeah. Uh, so we raise a lot of, we raise, uh, we have folks that come that are very, very generous. Mm -hmm. And we are able to raise many millions of dollars. And we fund uh, things like the Lilburn co uh, Food Co-op out there in Lilburn. Mm -hmm. uh, there is the food pantries here in Atlanta. So we're able to support the really good programs that are making a difference uh, for kids who would otherwise, like I say, uh, through no through no decisions of their own, sure. are in a really bad place. And I think it, this is so important to talk about on air and let people hear about this because I think that, you know, we have these fabulous events and people love to hear about those things and the party mm -hmm. and who was there and that sort of thing. But something that touches everybody is how this affects the community because, as you said, one in five kids in Georgia, this is down the street. This is right in our backyard. So it really does touch everyone well, watching. And I, I think a lot of people automatically assume that it's, you know, these are really poor kids in you know, the bad sections of town. Mm -hmm. No, this is everywhere. These are folks in the suburbs who, you know, for one, other, one reason or another, you know, their parents made some bad decisions and they're in a bad way. 
but it just seems quite unfair to me that a child who really doesn't have access to uh, make any changes in their life are made to sort of suffer through um, these very hard, difficult problems. Absolutely. Now, I want to end this on a fun note. I know that you provide some entertainment at these events, and I want to see just a little glimpse of what he does. As I said, uh, you are a sommelier, sommelier chair, and he brought a and sword. And I will need a lovely assistant. Would you mind? Oh, my God. What am I? Oh, this. Okay. And remember, was sometimes the scabbard is just a scabbard. <laughs> so what we're going to do is uh, we're going to um, actually, if you come, if you're coming uh, this Sunday, we'll be drinking uh, a little bit of Paul Roger okay. champagne to start things off. So if that's your thing, uh, absolutely. Oh, but uh, I'm going to uh, unhinge this just a little bit. I love to watch the saber, but I want a lesson later. Maybe absolutely. Ooh, All right, can ooh. we get a countdown from three? Three. All right, here we go. Three, three. two, one. <laughs> Woo! He made the shot. I don't know if you guys can hear that. There is a bucket over there. He made the I shot. I want to see everyone out there. I know you got yes. two, I know you got two big bills in your pocket. That's right. And I want you to come <laughs> buy a ticket. There's a few left, and we're going to have a great time this Sunday. Look them up. No Kid Hungry. This is the 12th annual Give Me Five dinner, five-course dinner. So fantastic what all of you are doing. Thank you so much. For more information, just log on to GiveMeFiveDinner.org.